But he does have a pocket Zelda. I don't want to say anything because they could hear us, so we could be coaching, but like... Zelda has a really sick down throw to forward that would go at any percent. Are you serious? Yeah. Dude, Roy is so combo dude. It's ridiculous. The only thing is like, it's really hard to get in, especially when he has the momentum, because Roy can cover a lot of options. Yeah, he just, he just builds up that wall. Yeah, not to mention like, the back air scares the crap out of me when you're getting popped up. And it's a lot more unforgiving than Mark in my opinion. Mark will try to go for his combo because more consistent. But Roy has that, he doesn't have any option of consistency. He will get that front smash in. And that's when things, just when you die at 40 or 50. Now the thing is like, Fox versus Roy, it's try to really like this matchup. But like, Reese likes any matchup where it relies on like heavy characters. Cause he's, I feel like, no, oh, that's weird. So Reese is a reactionary, almost a full reactionary type of guy. And Shrider, he's a Roy player, he has to go by reads. Yeah, reads, combos. And when you see when I play... Yeah, I next subs. When you see me play melee, when I do anything that just even seems like I jump in place, I tomahawk in place, I get punished off of that. He reacts to it. Only inside this game, I feel... The fact that the frame data was so different with me and Link and melee PMs, I was able to throw things we didn't know how long. I hit box straight up, I like this. Oh wow, that was really close. I was talking to Reese. Right to that. He was like, how do you even guard that? The fact is, I don't care what you say. It's almost impossible to guard Roy. The Roy really up here, right? Yeah. Can you light shield that? No, there's no light shielding in this game. Or like, the... oh, there isn't at all. Can you do the... Is, is like the shield thing that's still the same as the melee or no? Uh, it puts you in too much shield space. Not to mention, like, it'll... If you're full shield, then you're okay. But like, most times, it'll deplete your shield and shield poke your feet. Now, some Roy's can do, uh, some Roy's like is able to take up, but if you know that you could do a double jump into a B, you'll stay in that higher like float for like a whole second longer. No, I'm more exaggerating. 10, 20 frames. It was called a glitch since they fixed in 3.6. But you could just gotta treat it as like the hang time of Roy's or B is just super. Oh, you actually gotta roll right there. When you're uncomfortable with it though, like you have to be. I'm not gonna say frame perfect, but near frame good. Frame good. To like roll to the point where you're not getting hit and get the whole entire thing back. Unless you stole the second jump and you're going in, then yeah, you could roll easy. The fact you double jump with B, the hang time becomes super good. Oh wow. So that's what happens when you play a person who goes on reads versus a guy who can't be read. Yeah, that's, that's really cool. This is so hard to read. I think one with the star right there. Oh wow! You know what I'm saying? That looked like the, the double the, laser. The level nine. The level nine double, double laser up smash uh, down box, Computer and PM. Oh dude, shout out to the AI that knows how to do two godly techniques and only those two godly techniques. Multi shining, one. double lasering, and up smash. Oh, reverse. Let's try Happen to fix to the, the smallest stage in the game. Yep. You can see F smash kills at 30. But then Fox's up smash will also kill at like I don't kill him at like 80. Well, he's one of the heavier characters and the fast falling characters of the game. But 80 sounds right. Yeah, 80, 80 sounds alright. Right. Because 60 would be anyone else. And I feel like I the knockback like, goes is crazy on Fox's up smash, yeah, even though it's real. So it's like the more percentage just like exponentially goes that much better. Right, every laser counts. Every laser counts, <laughs> dude, especially when you're unstaling your moves. I don't melee, like, laser untails moves like hell, because your up smash and there does so much more damage. This game, it's, it's about the same. You do a little. Now, what I advise you people, especially in our stage, if you don't know, know that much out of the game, is that you want a small stage and your counter picking box, counter pick to a small stage with a large room. But gosh damn, you die so fast. Yeah, definitely not Yoshi's. I learned that the hard way. And when you play against me, you might look like my like I've living to a long time. It's because like I practice a lot on you. Especially when you play a link, you wanna like live with an up smash. But like you need you need space to convert your up momentum to your side momentum so the side momentum is up momentum. That's why you don't want these super small stages. Unless you know that you can kill off both ends, then yeah. But Fox, I'm pretty sure you can only kill by gems and upwards. Yeah, it's probably off the, off the side too. I mean, on the stage. Yeah, on the, on oh, that's the chain grab. Yeah, that's the chain. Oh. Did you see that? Yeah. Oh, shit. Sure, sure, let's go. 
It's looking like the melee version. Or that, that's like somewhat viable. Like, so you have to like wait for your opponent to not do anything. <laughs> Dang, okay, I was wrong about the man. I think the one. Yeah, that was really good, yeah. Yeah, that was good, yeah. Yeah, so the up smash, believe it or not, it doesn't send you straight up. It sends you at a very slight angle. And because of that slight angle, well, yeah, it becomes very crucial. There's like some kind of side theta physics going on, but like, for every slight edge for then you can convert that DI to a lot more. Dude, that was my game. It's a perfectly even game right now. I'm surprised Rista is so well on like super small pages. I guess like even Ganon, I don't know like, that's super great. Yeah, that I feel like I always thought like Fire, like when I play Mirror against him, I always thought like Fonse and Dream is always a good time for Duke Ganon. No, no, man. He, pro reaction players, pretty crazy. Especially if you like, you can count on your character to be with the perfect time. Even like, let's say you react right in time, you have to wait for your character animation. Fonse is the type of guy that will. Throw a headbox right when you want it to. Anyway, nice. <laughs> double grab. Nice knock from uh, Roy right there. Definitely. Only at 60 right now. If any damage right now counts. Oh, that was close. TM's all about being consistent. If you mess up once and you lose a stock for it, that's a game. Oh. Very good. So, anyway, as I said, that Roy, I mean, sorry, Foxy has a nice combo. Or just a clean stock. Well, I don't know. As I said, I follow. But I'm, I'm if you look at my YouTube account, Ooh. it's like 99%. I have like 14, 16 different PM smash scenes that upload weekly. Oh man. Back here. Roy needs to build a mo momentum oh, and just no. like that. Go down Did a for move. the DI, then press A. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you wanted the down tilt, but Definitely. it was too high percentage of crouch cancel. Game three. Even though crouching is so good in this game, sometimes it just kills yeah. it. I, I'm wondering if he's gonna go for a salty, because I feel like that is the best thing. But instead, it goes to this is, this, wow. is a, this is a big stage. This is something Fox does well on. So this is a short roof, but a big stage. Yeah. That's so this is this is actually a perfect stage for Fox. Not to mention like the fact that you have two of the options, the leaf and the bottom one. And yeah. Oh, so this is the last game. I don't wanna know like Roy's weakness. So I'm not gonna say right now, I'm gonna wait to the game. But he has a hard time covering options of Fox. This is totally yeah. close Fox. Because he has, he has a really good forward smash, really good down smash, down tilt, but then his, his like up tilt, up smash, it doesn't really cover anything. He only really does like 5%, yeah. barely knocks you back. He's giving you a punish just by getting hit by another enemy. The only way he can cover is with a F smash that's above his head. But it has to be right above his head. Oh, he should have just let him fall right there. Why don't go for style? I respect it. He's looking like he got the game right. I don't respect it. So we got the Out of 140, let's see what we can do. I, I, when you're high percentage man back air between skill and now it's not just up and camp, it becomes like... Oh, nice, nice weight on the ground. I'm surprised you didn't go for a... Tab into grab, yeah, heavy characters. The thing is that like, to play against a reaction air character, you gotta play on like, semi-reaction? You gotta down tilt before getting hit. You gotta grab before getting in. Just like that. Game. Fox is up with green stocks on last game. Okay, he's okay. gonna need a miracle to bring this back. But this I is this is not this necessarily our boy bad. We're talking about. This is our boy. This is not a bad matchup for player uh, for character one, but I think this is a bad matchup player one. Their their playstyle is super poor. Play so. See that was a, that was a reaction. So I don't think you do it. Well. Well, getting the down tilt is before the hit, getting the grab in during the dash dance, and it's about getting those like pokes without getting stuck. Oh, that was really close. That would have been a mistake. Yeah. So I think like random damage is perfect for like, just cause like there's no point, there's yeah. barely any punishment, and he has to get a nick of it. I think he needs to put more of like a wall. Nice. Oh, wow. yeah. that's... He needs that. I think he needs to build more of like a fair wall. Cause it seems like Fox is just running in like with no pressure and just getting like, three hits. Out. I would like to think that, but I don't know. Reese is something weird where it's like he's, he's good at the Marth matchup. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. But I went Final Destination against him and he beated me. And I'm a Marth main inside this game. It's pretty crazy. And then like there was to be another Marth on Final Destination. I'm like, why? How? Like he just he's okay at the Marth. Match. 
So he's good against the people who put up a wall. What you gotta do is you gotta like put up a wall right before it's Oh, nice words. Let's see, hold on to that stock, bro. Okay, I wanna. Oh, hit. Oh, I wanna believe. I would like to believe. believe in the boy. Please. Oh, the move punish nice. in the counter, but that's clean. Big game. So yeah, a good way to right. play against Roy is like you do a battlefield camp right above him. The only thing you can do is jump up there. 